Welcome to Miss Kimberly's magical, musical, mindful adventure. <sighs> From my home to yours. I'm so glad you're here because I was just using my magical power of imagination to imagine that I was a little froggy sitting on a log. Ribbit, croak. Can you be a froggy? Turn your toes out. Bend your knees and then sink your hips all the way down so your elbows go inside of your knees and your hands come up to your heart. And now you're a frog. Croak, croak. Hmm. I wonder how long a frog can croak for. Let's come back to sitting crisscross applesauce for a little while while we do some experimenting with our singing voice. All right. Let's start by taking a huge deep breath in our belly, filling it up. And as you let out your breath, let's see how long we can sing croak for. Ready? Croak. That was a long time. This time, let's fill our bellies. Make our hands really small so there's a tiny space between your hands. And as you croak, you're gonna start quiet. Get really loud! And then come back to really quiet. Are you ready? Take a big deep breath. part of your froggy croaking voice and get to the highest part of your froggy voice. Take a deep breath. Here we go. Croak. <laughs> Good job. Are we ready to get back into our froggy pose? All right. Jump back into your froggy pose. How high can a froggy hop? Let's find out. Jump as high as you can and then land right back in your froggy pose. Here we go. Wow, I almost touched my ceiling. Did you? Let's try again. See if you can land silently back in your froggy pose. Ready? Whoa, that was even higher. But. Sometimes it does get lonely just being a frog here all by myself. I know, I'll imagine that a friend comes to meet me. How about a doggy friend? Let's put our hands down, walk our feet back, and wiggle our tail back and forth and say ruff, 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 ruff. The froggy, the dog, is going to spot the frog and come racing all the way across the bog to come sit right next to the froggy. But first, can you hop? in your dog pose. I wonder if the doggy can hop just like the frog. Wiggle your tail to the sky and then hop. Let's try with our other foot. Wiggle your tail to the sky and hop. Whoop. Sorry, tree. <laughs> All right. I think you're ready for the song. Here comes little frog. Start in your frog pose. Little, little frog was sitting on a log. Here comes the jump. Hop. <gasps> I'm a free, free frog. Okay, back to your dog pose. Wiggle your tail. And let's run. Try your hop. <sighs> now we're sitting together. Let's hop one more time. <sighs> and now let's rest. <sighs> Take your child pose with your knees down, lying your forehead down, and pause for a deep breath. <sighs> 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 
Wow, it feels so nice to rest in child pose. Let's do it for one or two or three or four more breaths. So we bend our knees, reach your arms forward, bring your forehead all the way down and take three deep breaths. <sighs> I feel much better now. To end our adventure, let's bring our hands up to our hearts. Use your magical powers to make your hands warm with all of your warm energy, all of your love right between your hands. Send a burst of magical love down to the earth. Send a burst of magical love to all the plants and animals and people here on the earth. Send a burst of your magical love to the whole universe. <sighs> and one more big burst of magical love right to yourself. <sighs> See you next time.